Hey guys, what's up? In this video, we'll be going through how we can fix automation server can't create object error on Windows. So without any further ado, let's get right into it. So the first solution is to change security settings and clearing browser data. So to do that on Internet Explorer, we'll be first opening up Internet Explorer and clicking the cog icon on the top right corner to open up the drop down menu. Then from the menu, click Internet Options and then wait for the window to open. Then navigate to the security tab and click on trusted site. Now we have to click uh, custom level option in security level for this zone section. Then scroll until you reach the ActiveX controls and plugins. Now we have to make sure that the checkbox initialize and script ActiveX controls not marked as safe for scripting uh is enabled so now hit ok now head back to internet options and this time we'll navigate to general tab and under the browsing history section uh, click on delete button now make sure that you check the boxes next to uh, temporary internet files and websites then cookies and website data and tracking protection and likewise for activex filtering and do not track then finally click delete button and restart your computer to see if the problem still appears on your pc or not now the next step is to open up the registry editor by hitting windows key along with r and then typing in reg edit then navigate to the following registry so now that you are in that registry click on the key and try to locate an error named 1201 in case it's not there create a new d word value entry called 1201 by right clicking at the right side of the window and choosing new and then going to d word 32 bit value now in the edit window under the value section change the value to 3 and apply the changes you have so now you have to make sure that the base value is set to decimal then confirm any security dialogs which may appear during this process so now you can restart your PC and check to see if the problem is gone or not. So in case if you want to avoid this registry step, what you can do is you can hit Windows key along with R and then type in gpedit.msc in the run dialog. So you can open up local group policy editor. So once the local group policy editor is open under computer configurations, you can double click on administrative templates and then navigate to Windows components and then Internet Explorer then internet control panel and then go to security page and then internet zone likewise then we have to head over to internet zone folder by left clicking on it and then check out the right side section here we have to double click on the initialize and script activex controls not marked as safe or scripting uh, option and then simply check the radio button next to enable option then finally click ok and restart your pc and see if the problem still persists or not so the solution number two involves resetting internet explorer settings so open up internet explorer and hit the cog icon on the top right corner and go to internet options then navigate to advanced tab and then click on reset then select the delete personal settings checkbox if you would like to remove the browsing history search providers accelerators home pages and and in private filtering data. Click OK and when the Internet Explorer finishes applying default settings, click close. Then see if the issue still persists or not. So hopefully these solutions would have resolved the issue for you guys. Make sure that you give this video a thumbs up and subscribe to our YouTube channel. We'll see you in the next one. Take care. Bye.